registration access for assistant dean and advisors to register undergraduate students starting from online registration date fall 2019 to 2021 and onwards. Before you start, student course registration code in banner is SFAREGS. Course registration status codes description RW registration through SSB, RE is registration through INB, DD is drop or delete, DW is withdrawn with a W grade. To start the registration, access the Banner 9 link, enter your username and password, network credentials, click sign in, this screen will then appear. Type in the search text box SFAREGS. This form is used to register directly through the banner. The following screen will then open automatically. Just close this by clicking on the X here. Once this is closed, then this window SFAREGS will open and just enter the following fields term here. and student ID number here. Then click on the Go button. This registration window will then open. And here you can see three title headers. So block one is the enrollment information. Here you'll see the status of the student if he or she is eligible to register or not, the minimum and maximum credit hour, and the minimum and maximum credit hour a student can register. Block 2 is course information. This is where you'd enter the CRNs and register the student. And block 3 is the enrolment totals. So to navigate through the title headers or blocks, just click on the next section icon at the bottom of the page or press the Alt page down keys on the keyboard. This will take you to the enrollment information data section. Nothing needs to be done here, so tap Alt page down on your keyboard or the next section icon. And this will take you to the course information block. To register a course, make sure you're in the course information block. Click on insert to add a CRN. If the CRN number is known, then enter it here. If the CRN number is unknown, then you can search for it using the following steps. So go to an empty block under the CRN column in the course information. Then click on the three dots. This window will then appear and just click on search for sections. Enter the search criteria. So the subject code, i.e. ACC, and the course number, for example, 202. If you want to add more search criteria, then just click on add another field from the drop-down list, such as campus. If you need to add another filter, for example, available seats, then click again on add another field and add the search criteria, such as greater than zero. So then click go and you'll see the following outcome. Just double click on the required CRN and then the section will be added to the student. So then just click save or Add more sections by repeating the previous steps. If the section isn't saved due to an error like the one shown here, please just do the following. Change the status from RE to DD. Delete the record and click Save. 
Please note that the registration window shouldn't be open for more than one user at the same time. So for example, a student and advisor can't open the banner 9 for admin and banner web for student at the same time. The window should be closed, otherwise they won't be able to access the student account from the banner pages due to the session being locked. If the student has any registration hold, as shown here, the advisor and assistant dean will not be able to do any registrations. The student must sort out the hold issues. If the advisor and assistant deans are not able to register the student in the section due to registration restriction, the college must communicate with the RO team.